Yo, what's up guys? It's Zoe. It's Cody. And it's Zoe, Zoe. Back today with another YouTube video. Today we're doing another episode of Sip or Spill, which... Go get your merch. I hope you guys enjoy. Make sure you do like and subscribe, and let's get right into it. Alright, I'm going to be giving you guys a list of topics. If you guys want to respond to it, you know, you say it. Sip if you spill. don't, sip it up. Alright, our first one is Keo being left behind oh when the boys from the Sway House went to Texas. Oh my god. I'm gonna spill on this one. I think it was completely like stupid. Like, they even know it was stupid. I wouldn't want to wake up to all my friends gone and not telling me. Like, that's all I have to say. Like, no shade to them. Like, but like, I wouldn't want to wake up and like be alone in the house. <laughs> I mean, like, I do agree, but it's just, it wasn't that serious. Alright, our next topic. I'm not gonna give you details about the topic. I'm just gonna give you a list of three names. Okay. Okay. Jaden. Mads, Charlie uh, Jordan. That whole thing is just like relationship, and it's just like I never want to get into that. It means that we have, you know, our I relationship. Just, like, I'm gonna stay. I barely even know about it, so. Bryce Gum and Bryce uh, Hall and their online feud. Mm, that's some tea that I'm interested in. You're gonna sit, really? Mm hmm. So Bryce sent out shots to Bryce Gum saying that he was gonna like take his girl. I actually think it's funny. I mean, it's just like online drama. I don't think it's not that serious at all. It's just all funny games. But people take it way too seriously. Like people are coming at Bryce like so hard. Well, speaking about Bryce Gum's girlfriend, the contract between Bryce Gum and his girlfriend, where he can collect yeah. his money at any time. Yeah, I'm gonna. Okay, so this is a topic we brought up last week, but it still is currently happening and it's actually escalated. So last week we talked about Noen tweeting about how he wanted to leave Ooh. TikTok. Uh -huh. um, and this week he actually uploaded a video where he got fairly emotional and was crying oh um, about wanting to leave TikTok. No, I'm, I'm gonna spill on this one. <laughs> go, go for it. Rant out. This app is toxic. With a capital T O X I C. Okay. Mm -hmm. Like, Factual. toxic. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Ridiculous. Mm -hmm. The amount of hate videos that get on my For You page of people just being complete jerks to other people, it's like pathetic. Like, whatever happens to people in their past should stay in their past and not be brought back up. If somebody does something wrong, uh -huh. yes, good like, well. it's nobody else's business but that person. Like, every everything you do has a consequence. Like, just let us realize what we did wrong and move on from it like whenever zoe ran she just like go so you go serious no. so i didn't take a drink so obviously i'm gonna spill i completely agree with no one obviously i'm not gonna make it all booey booey <laughs> but he's completely right the app is toxic just like zoe said but, but i love the app at the same time so i can't say anything. i don't i just like it that's all i'm gonna say Alright, so not only has 6 9 returned <laughs> from prison, <laughs> this released is wild. a song, this is wild. had his clapback moment with the most viewed Instagram live with 2 million active Dude, no, users, literally. but the Hype House commented on his Instagram story inviting him over. Oh my god. <laughs> that, that's not a collaboration I want to see. I don't want to see that. No. <laughs> <laughs> what? Like, what are you laughing about? I mean, it's just like they're two complete opposite brands. Yeah, like that's so it's opposite. Like, like he's a whole like rapper. He's a whole man. And, like he's a grown man. I don't know. Like no shade to the hype house, but like I, I just can't see the collab. Like I just can't. All right, our next one. I know Zoe's gonna want to spill. <laughs> He's very wants to smile. <laughs> OG Musers coming oh. back for a collaborative TikTok mm -hmm. trend. Okay, so I do want to spill on this because here's the thing. I've had people duet the video of me doing that, saying that I'm not an OG. Yeah. And so many people have told me that I'm not an OG. Mm -hmm. I've been on the app since 2014. I blew up in the mid-range of 2015. Like, that's when I got verified was 2015. And I, like, blew up from then. 
like musically is how I started off. Like musically is the reason why I'm like big on TikTok now too. This is the series. I part. think that it's freaking amazing that the OGs are doing that because I miss musically. I miss the mm -hmm. old people on the app. Like it was just so much more fun and like you didn't have to worry about getting slandered in your entire comment section. You'd have like two hate comments. Like by anybody. It doesn't matter what you did. And like people weren't so What's the word like? This is what I'm talking about, no, 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 guys. No, 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 this is what I'm no. talking this is, about. This is important. People weren't so like mad over little things on Musically now that they are on TikTok. Like they wouldn't get so triggered over something. Like, but if you do it on TikTok now, it's like. I mean, that's everywhere though. That's like that's like society. Slam. Oh my god, that's like society. That's on Instagram, Twitter, so Snapchat. My that's on every. Woo! <laughs> I am done. Okay, next one, we have Lisa and Lena returning. Woo! That was so iconic. I was like, those are my queens. Are you good? My acai bowl is here. My acai bowl is just here. Go get your food. Wait, okay. I'll be right back. I got some strawberries. <laughs> All right, now it's Super Spill with Cody Orlov. Back today with another YouTube video. Play the drama on me, bro. It's Chad. Haley Morales' family hiring someone to beat up another girl. You know, um, I'm gonna go up. Uh, I'm gonna go. Sorry, I had to go get my Postmates. I'm back. Haley Morales' family paying someone to beat up a girl. That is crossing the line for me. It's crossing the, the line for me too, but I, I don't know if it's true or not. I hope it's not true. I hope it's not true either. That's really messed up. Our last one. Dixie D'Amelio publicly stating her political views online. Oh, I did see that. I did see that. That was a mistake, Dixie. You never, you never post your political. Yeah, you I can say? just did never like. I love Dixie though. Thank you guys so much for watching Sip or Spill. I know this week was a little bit hectic, but I hope you guys did enjoy. Make sure you do like and subscribe. And make sure you comment down below your opinions on the drama that we talked about in this video today. And I hope you enjoyed. Also, before the video ends, a new cow t-shirts just dropped. Go to shopwithzody.com or click the first link in the description and go get your merch. Donut merch comes out soon. Talks. Bye-bye.